military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit, unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. Okay. Mission control. I can watch the hypnotic rolling of the waves and listen to you at the same time. Oh, okay. What did I say? Just Little Miss, Megan. I can see and hear things at the same time. The cookies are great on Edwards Island. Used to be great, but you passed. Thank you. You're welcome. So you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. This is my boyfriend. Did your mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a. You know, I guess I'm actually, leaving. I'm not even gonna tell this story. Boring. It's no. Really it's not, not worth it. <laughs> okay. No, wait, what happened? I feel like I haven't heard this. He got lost in some gardens and he thought she worked there and blah blah blah, they hit it off. Aw. Uh, I just kissed you. Adorable. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um, I'd been out of school what? and the timing had just never worked out. So. You have, what? Yeah, Does that take you to her then? Hey, uh, second cousin? I don't know how people math works. Um, step brother, technically. Oh yeah. I guess that's just I now. forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house, sharing your toothbrush, wearing your clothes, eating your food. Yeah, sure, whatever. I have someone to reach the food on the top shelf now. Oh, do I have a just boyfriend? Just happy to be on the team. So, how oh, do what? you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned Ew. potato blobs. Ah, Ren, why are you even talking about this? It's humorous, right? It's just interesting. I That's think I it's laugh. interesting. It is, I guess. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. Okay. This will be like the before shot. They're on. Fine, just <laughs> Fine. the camera out. Sorry, I interrupted you. I don't look no, my I... freshest right Why now. Why am I so sad? It's true, Jonas. This is like B minus Alex. Just for your uh, calibration. All right, let's take a picture. And it's Jonas? Selfie. Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. Um, polio. <clears throat> Here's good. Just for a picture. Come on. Best there, picture ever. Great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Alright, mwah. Hey, Alex. Mwah. You brought the radio, right? The little portable one? What radio? That little, you know, the little, it almost looks like a toy. The, uh, oh, oh, you're joking. Just bring it out, will you? Yes. There's the little guy. Oh. Our high school has a radio station. And I had Chloe, it in my back. She's a friend I of mine. my boy. She's <laughs> filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters yes, that is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, Wheeler. about our thing. So, tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. Uh-oh. Which I played because that song has been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But This one. Oh. Oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddy... It said it was 8 o'clock. ...down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach, or whatever we call it now. Yeah, okay. we are. I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. Love baby carrots. Dance, 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 <laughs> dance. Oh, what the awesome. hell? I, I wanted to Christina, dance. I Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. Challenge show judge face. Did you say something, Boat? We must be getting close. There's no Boat. radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, so is my no. boyfriend? You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see.
Oh, what a cute picture. I have blue hair and everything. Why does my air conditioning work when I'm like awake but not when I'm asleep, actually? Like, it gets super duper fucking cold. Oh, do I press something? No. It gets super cold, like, when I'm uh, fucking not even, like, when I don't need it to be cold. Like, I know I said I was hot, but, like, when I go to sleep, it's really hot. And then my air conditioning don't even fucking work. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Nope. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. <laughs> yeah, um, anybody need to smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, Ew. no thanks. I, mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, that's really you can gross. bum one off me if you're empty. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. Last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, just checking. Alright, my other friends friend anymore. up and around the bed. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh, really? Just... That's kind of... It'll take three minutes tops. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. It's like a buddy system. So let's be buddies. Um, just never mind. I've already made everyone uncomfortable, so... No, it's... You're not making anyone uncomfortable, but... I mean, let's oh, all just go up. This. We're like at hour one here. You'll have ample family bonding time. Uh, yeah, fine, sure, no problem. Okay, yeah, speed buddy. read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric like named walk. Mrs. Adler. But, wow. as God is my witness, we'll never mention her- Store. It's kinda kitschy, right? It's kinda kitschy. What? The town? I like it. I like kitschy stuff. Okay. It's like the opposite of ugly, scratchy nature. So, I'm to summarize, you. we are not allowed here after dark. The town is shut down, you. and we, the Kamina High are class, me? Yeah, you're have following come me. to commit improper acts. Does this go anywhere? More closed stores or trees? I don't know, but it's not where we're going. It's silent hills. Like the town's youths keep the whole slink over and camp thing. Can I drop well. this car? No, no, no. I um, I, I got it. Uh, yeah. Isn't this supposed to be like a giant swarming animal mask wearing freakout? Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because <laughs> when you go game. to the... It's like the front. The mouth? The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to station... Ah, oh, I forgot this was even here. So, this is cool. What is it? It's a it's memorial a for a fucking submarine. Alex, tune to 102.3 so we can hear the guy. It's kind of a weird little, like, feature of the island. Uh, okay, sure. It's just, uh, 102.3. Won't take long, I promise. It's right here. I'm on it. Really? It's, uh, it's pretty interesting. Nah, it's alright. I don't have to hear it. Uh, anyways, Jonas, it's like the only time in history an American sub was destroyed in our waters or something like that. Its propeller was the one thing recovered, so they made it into, like, a monument. The crew are listed on the plaque thing. War is hell. Right, the only description it. for war is Can I do war. it right here, actually? So yeah, we brought the radio because in the cave you can hear a bunch of spooky crap. Really? Really? Named after the Hawaiian god of the Oh, there we go. The USS it's, um, Kanaloa was pretty launched creepy. on January 15th, At least I've heard. I did it once. And commissioned into it's amazing when it works. So, back up a second. Who's Earl Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owns some of the island or something? I'm trying to let you do it for like 70 years. She's kind of what you'd call a local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. Man, that woman won the life lottery. 70 years of sleeping with the window open. Oh, hey, this is the Parks and Facilities office. Didn't, I'm really didn't your sister I'm Allison work here? Allie? I like yeah, this game. Allie for a few years, actually. Easy money, since nobody's allowed in the parks and barely anybody here needs facilities. But you'd be okay with never leaving. Oh, really? what the hell are you doing? Can we run? Yeah, why wouldn't I be? If you're happy, you're happy. Why would you move? 
Yeah, why would you? Jonas, did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? Oh, really? Yeah, so... Don't and did this little birdie tell everyone he did Susie Lyons even though it was only oh, over the pants stuff? He uh, did her. Huh. Just because Mark spends his study hall at the advisory board doesn't <clears throat> mean he's allowed to look through our submissions. Look, Alex, I just... If you are... This game is really cool. Me, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. That's all. That's my whole spiel. What the hell does that mean? Nothing, nothing, nothing at all. Kiss Do what me. you want. Forget I said anything. Thanks so much for bringing me out, you guys. I can tell I'm gonna have a really good time. Oh, shut up. The beaten path officially ends here. I think Jerry told me that the there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. Ugh, perfect. Well, just wait a minute and let me think. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Thanks, boyfriend. Dancing, dancing, dancing. Yeah, thanks for helping, nerd. What? Sure. What are we doing? Oh, we're going over the fence. Okay. Non Pam. Let's go. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> oh god. Who's that? That's so there's this girl, Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just, you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything, all right? Deal? Well, relax. Oh, what was the thing you wanted to say to Alex Jonas? You can just pretend I'm like a stray dog and can't understand. Uh, it was nothing, really. Yeah, what was it really, Jonas? If you have some deep, dark secret, I'd like to know now before we're officially housemates. I'll just talk to you later, seriously. You wanna kiss me? Reginald, <clears throat> I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying, I was about to tell a story, what was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well, Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm wait. gonna sit on your head. Oh, mm, yeah. Hey. We started uh, yeah. a fire down Hi. the way. Hi. And Jonas, that's- Who are you? Jonas. That's Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Oh. Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Uh, yeah, you'd think he'd be a little old to need a babysitter, but here we are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, so if I don't have anyone to burp me, it becomes a real issue. Wait, wait, wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? Whoops, that I was dating my is stepbrother. Clarissa. How but are she's... you her stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um, uh, her mom is marrying my dad, so, you know. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... I bet he still loves me. <sighs> Where is everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, <laughs> that's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Ugh, come on, Clarissa. I'm fun. Not I'm Clarissa. Hip. I'm with it. Listen oh, wow. to yourself. Wait, no, you're not. aren't you all like friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to like a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. Hey, <laughs> what about me? What about you? Bitch. Oh, I get it. I'm not even on the spectrum. You see, Jonas. Normally, you want to fucking fight like me? Twenty deep fight me right but now. Pat had a fight last weekend, me. And... and a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on, to We're the on beach. Edward. Fuck all of you. I'm fine. I'm here. I'm with <coughs> it. Fire! Man's great equalizer. So what's the um what's the like thing to do here? Other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Well, I'm up for pretty much whatever, so. Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. This is what yeah. I do for fun. Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, we all gotta go sometime. In her case, <sighs> later than sooner. And to answer your previous question... I'm gonna throw all... Jonas, I bet this is your fucking rocks. I'm gonna throw every single one of them in the damn river. Don't go and fucking get him. Play don't slap. go get him, Harry. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Truth or slap? 
What's oh, that? Well. We used to call it hippo until we Pick got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Stroke because fire. you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo before you slap someone. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth. But if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth <laughs> who ever truthed, All right, let's uh, just get on with it. I'm gonna hit oh, run. Okay. So, first, we're gonna... I'll start. Run. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You wanna go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait. I wanna hear... Oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it... Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something that like... That is not me. I know you want to sample the goods, now no, just face it. I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's, I'm gonna go over here and I get just a like her as a friend. banana. That's, that's all. She's cool. She's... she's just a friend. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, thank you. All right. Great, let's just move on. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! What? <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, please. Shoot, I can take it. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? What? It's fun. It's funny, I don't know. And Jonas is family now, technically. So he's excluded. I'd probably marry Clarissa. I'm married. Why? <laughs> why? Right there. I mean, why in God's name would you marry me, of all people? What? You're a catch. Uh, just to make you mad. And get half your stuff in the divorce. <laughs> oh, whatever. Who cares? Yep. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. Um, Who'd you do the dirty with? Nona. She seems like she'd be present and giving, unlike some people here. Thank hey, you. I'm present. I wouldn't lose my place or nothing. Scout's honor. Oh, God, this is such a horrible turn. And wait. Yep. Wait, that means you kill me? Out of yeah. everyone here. Your best friend. Hey, you wanted to know. And I'm the only guy. <laughs> this is Miss Andrew. Miss Andrea, I said. I'm okay, lesbian. Okay, settle down. So, Alex's turn? Yep. yep. Lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great. Here we go. What's your favorite stuffed animal? Professor. Clarissa. Oh, boy. That's yes, right. Mom? This is pretty fun just watching, I'll admit. Well, Do you like anyone? Like, like, uh -oh. like anyone? There's no one in school worth liking now. Oh, wow. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. So, no, I don't. But nice try. Clarissa's turn now. Alex, you got a new brother. Pretty exciting. Yep. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. Uh -huh. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm, um... Is there, like, a question coming or what? <laughs> I'm a I'm sassy just saying bitch. what Jonas is already thinking. That What's statistics he saying? show if you get divorced once, you're probably going to get divorced again. And God. the fact is, your mom divorced your dad, so wow. let's put his mind at ease and hear why. Uh, okay, I, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The bitch. point is, why'd your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce, just that- You know why. Michael died and it broke everything and they couldn't handle it. The end. Well, now you know, Jonas. There you go. Don't die and everything will be fine. <laughs> okay, Clarissa, you- What? You know, guys, honestly, I think I'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game. Okay. Wait, let's let's not stop like this. We should. Like... Game's over, Ren. I won, and to celebrate, I'm gonna sit you on the You can't win games drink, like this. Maybe if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we could. And get... that's exactly what Nona's gonna do too. Man, what is your problem, Clarissa? Just what did we? What did I do to make you act like I ate the last piece of chocolate cake on your flippin' last... birthday? Hey, nothing, Alex. I'm getting up and fighting you, you. Absolutely nothing. I'm fighting you right now. Cheese! If Throwing you guys are scavenger you. hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosy, happen to find anything more interesting than a blah, slowly blah, blah. dying Eat starfish, it. you be sure to just let me know. Eat Super. Uh, if we find anything more interesting than that, I think we'll be too involved in our own fun to come get you. Well, wouldn't you know it? That's just fine by me. Whatever. I'm throwing this rock and you well, can't do anything about it. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. No, no, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Lake it. Jonas is strapping young life. Ain't it right now. boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I I'll guess you, you expect me to just fence. jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. I'm Where coming. are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh, yeah. Is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Me first, me first, me first. What? You love him? 
Yeah, Alex, you want to check out the caves? Or? Yes! Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up? Yeah, come on. <sighs> Let me put down my drink. What a fucking litter! I'll push you over. <laughs> oh, oh, I forgot. We never talked about John. Oh, what, their date? Yeah, Thanks. he, uh... So, the cave. We went to that weird What's your bets? Carnival? On a scale of one to ten, how weird's it gonna be? Hmm, probably a five? Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. I'm a bummer. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. No, you're fine. Eh, it's not your fault. I think somebody dumped pig's blood on her in a previous life, and now she just wants to get ahead of the curve. Yeah, that's her name. Yeah, her probably. name's actually Thanks Carrie for, Stena. Uh, not ratting me out to Nona during the, uh, the game. I didn't think you would, but... You know, you could have, and you didn't, so thanks. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't throw you in the deep end or anything. Not like a certain person who yelled at Andrew Finnegan about a certain junior high dance right in the middle of gym no. class. No! That was a joke, and oh. he agreed. Oh, so, wait, no regrets. actually, I almost forgot. What? Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Brownie Town. Magic? They're with marijuana. Mean? It means they're enhanced with certain qualities hmm well maybe just don't eat too much no promises hmm delicious gross okay so see these little piles of rocks the kids yes. before us always leave them here so you know where to try and tune in the signals so you're gonna oh, okay. stand basically right around here and just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness okay so right here how will we know when it's Oops, sorry, I pulled out my map and said. You'll know. Trust me. It's like Morse code or something. It's even cooler than I thought it would be. This what is... What is it? What's doing it? Maybe the Ouch. tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> huh. It doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy, then. Because I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes, too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. This is so cool. Huh. I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some oh, reason, I but like it. They, they're Michael fine where they are. Five seconds, like three oh. years ago. Five it was seconds. for a couple of months, a year and a half ago. Oh. She should just seriously get over it already. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so. Huh. Brownies are kicking in. That oh, makes wow. sense. Yeah, it did to me. Okay, good. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. Well, yeah, there's a pile, stupid. God, it sounds so... Yeah, it sounds... Uh... It's freaking me out a little. <laughs> yeah. I like it. Wait, what was that? No, why? It's like, this is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous I last know. words. Famous last words. Uh, yeah. What is that? I'm sure there is something in Let there, me up like here. a giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears. Let me up wings. here. Stop looking at or it yourself. It kind of looks like a pool or something, like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's check it out. Okay. It's not that far in. <laughs> oh. If it's a pool, that'd be cool. I, um, didn't mean that to rhyme. <laughs> I did. Cool pool. Cool pool. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Wait a minute! Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here. Because I think... Shh, I think I mismeasured the magic. Oh, bless it. 
What a great picture of all saw of all saw. 10 p.m. Jonas. 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 Oh, you got up here fast. I like this game. I hope it doesn't like fucking end up like damn. What was it? It was fucking uh. Fox tails or whatever. Freaking never alone. I literally stopped playing as soon as it turned into a human too. All right, you can get down. Damn. Get what? What are you doing? What are you doing, you freak? Just get down. Get down. There. Thank you. No, stop. Cl stop climbing it. Oh lord. There we go. Jonas! Hey -ya! Hey! -ya! Jonas, seriously, where are you? <coughs> Jonas! He's not here. I'm gonna jump down. Tell me where you are, I'm gonna kill myself! Fuck, like, I swear to God, if you fucking... This is the pool that you saw? All the way down here. Are you shitting me? The breeze. Why would a guy bring an ashtray down here? Or a pen? To write notes about his ashtray. Damn, Jonas, you're fast as hell. Spree a man. See a man. <laughs> see a man about a dog. See a man about a dog. Sure, will do. Didn't you hear yeah. me calling for you? Jesus, you scared me. Yeah. I... What are you even doing? I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought, I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know, obviously there isn't. But isn't this place incredible? You just love I mean, it. I don't hardcore. even know how this, how this happens. See, that's what I heard. Oh, that's weird. It sounds like a person almost, right? Kinda? I don't know where it's coming from. Maybe it is someone. You ever think of that? Maybe it's wow. some crazy yeah, guy Jonas. he's gonna eat out our stomachs. He's gonna <laughs> eat my stomach well, where right is he out. Then? In which of these tiny air holes? Like, what is this made out of? Is it ice? What? Oh, it's wow, a how is that? Did, did you see the floating, um, triangle light thing? Um, yes. It, it must be like a... Like a rainbow, or like a reflection of light? Those, um, exist, right? Um, cave, triangle rainbows? Uh, maybe? Until I <laughs> think I hadn't heard about parrotfish either, so I guess anything's possible. I think this is all tied to when you tuned in those weird signals out there in the, um, what am I trying to say? I, I think that you tuned in this little guy somehow. I think it's all the same thing. No. No way! There's like 20 things wrong with that idea, with the number so, one being radios don't conjure light beams. Come on, it happened outside. It's not that far-fetched. Let's talk about this wardrobe Try your radio. Here. Maybe that's like a frequency or something. Like if it'll have an effect. Um, There's a big triangle just sitting up there waiting to hear some weird static. This, what the fuck? Are you... Is this... You? Are you doing this? Wait. Why did you stop? We don't even know what that thing is. Yeah, exactly. Let's find out. Ugh. We're jiggling! I'm gonna see what this is. Oh my god, seriously? Again? I wanna see what this wardrobe is. Well, great. You broke it. Saw the man, but not the dog. Alright, fucking find the Jonas. God. I better.
gonna be able to see what that wardrobe is. Good question. Like this. Sun says that's an old communications tower, and I don't know about you, but I want to climb that ladder, call somebody, and get the hell back home as fast as possible. I don't want to be the party pooper here, but the party just kind of pooped its- I don't know. This is kind of exciting, right? Exciting? Alex, we don't- To think something's exciting, you kind of have to know what that something is first. And we just got crapped out of the laser light show from hell, so... I'm not sure this qualifies as, like, something good. Harden Tower. Oh, it's called that, I think, because the radio man who watched it, he was Major Richard Harden. I don't know why I remember that. <laughs> Wait, the guy's name was Major Dick Harden? <laughs> <laughs> yep. It almost makes the whole trip worth it, doesn't it? I wouldn't go that far. I know you think this stuff is fun my favorite or whatever, one. but I'm sorry. We don't really know what's going on. Oh, come on. Are you scared? Is that it? You're scared? Yeah, I'm scared. Scaredy so far as cat. I don't want to get hurt Scaredy or cat. killed, I'm and I don't want my sister to get hurt or killed either. I'm gonna bite my butt. I'm gonna bite my butt. You have to regret this, okay? I'm gonna bite my butt. Okay, fine. You are such a wet blanket. And you sound a like my blanket. grandmother, so you're well on your way to being a lousy drunk who can't hear very well. Oh, and not for nothing. I'm fine with a little de pantsing or whatever if the weather's right for it. But if this is some sort of prank or trick, I'm really, really not in the mood. So if it is, the time to come. Jonas, How? what? You what think I somehow prank? teleported us here? If I could do one tenth of what happened back there, I wouldn't haze the new kid. I'd rob a bank. Maybe that's your exactly. Wednesday. Just cross your fingers the comm tower has a working walkie-talkie or something. Wait, Jonas, seriously, like, what just happened? My radio... I can see the cave, but not Ren or anybody. What do you think happened to them? Uh, 
probably heard all the noise and ran off instead of trying to come help us. God. Great. What a bummer. Shondor. Yeah. It's gonna be long though. Surprise. <sighs> it's locked. Let me try. <sighs> and what exactly can you do except jiggle it more? Oh, you'll see. What's the expression? Skills of a misspent youth? That's not an expression. <clears throat> well, if you want to do things the easy way, sure. <laughs> Here you go. I was smart. Ah! Ah! Radio, help! Is, um... Is anyone there? Oh great, it's Satan. It's, um, dead. It's Satan. Did you get anyone? I don't think so. Warning, do not use aboard ship. Unsafe radiation limits. You know, I'd normally find this stuff kind of interesting, really. You know, normally. You don't have to make me feel better about getting you trapped on Horror Island. Horror Island? That sounds a little different than what we're on right now. Why would you think I said Horror Island? Um, I don't know. I'm offended. What's this? Fence should be off now. Great, but um, don't take offense if I want to throw a stick at it first. Come on, don't you trust me? The light turned off. I trust you to, like, not hurt me on purpose or anything, but, you know, if the fence kills me on accident, it's not really about trust at that point. <sighs> Fine, let's leave. What's this? Let's call someone. There's a dial tone, but there's a note here. Does not call out. Please dial station code for service. There wouldn't happen to be a code there, would there? Nope. Oh, great. <laughs> Jesus! Ah, ah, answer the phone, hurry! Hello? Alex? Alex? When? Oh, Jesus, Hoppin' Christ! Thank Vishnu! I, you guys went into that hole and a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what happened. What I just hell? woke up like 15 minutes ago. I, I saw the light on in the, uh, the tower thing. Hey, did you know that it's named after some guy named Dick Harden? <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> it's still funny. Ren, how are you calling us? Phones don't work here. <laughs> it's it's a code written on this list here. Tell me, hurry. But it's not a normal phone. I can't call out. I'm at uh the way station or whatever in the woods. It's been like like just the worst thing ever. Just why how did you get all the way out there? Did you just take off sprinting when I went after Jonas? No, like I said, I must have like passed out or I don't know how I ended up here. Wait, I I, I think that's the other line. Maybe it's like a night watchman or something, or they do like check-ins, maybe? What? Wait, Ren, someone's calling on the other line. Just hold on a minute. I'm gonna see who it is. Okay, but make it quick, seriously. Fine. Hello? Oh, Jesus Christ, Alex? Why are you answering in this? It says it's an emergency line. Where are you right now? Clarissa. And Jonas is with you. Of course he is. Okay, look, Clarissa. Ren's on the other line and sounding like he's about a stub toe away from a total collapse, so if you're at least holding it together, Wait, wait, then... wait, I... I'm at Fort Milner, and I can't... I don't remember, like, the last hour, and it's, like, really scaring the crap out of me. I'm trying to call somebody, but I'm in a room with radio stuff that can... It says it can contact Kamina, but I don't... I have no idea how to make it work. Can you just come over here and figure this out with me? I don't care if you guys want to stay... No, I just, just come here instead. Fort Milner's all the way on the other side of the island. Yeah, I know it is, Alex, but why would I go to the comm tower when there's a working radio that we can use to get help here? Yeah, Fort we got Milner one too. Fort looks huge on the map. Do you know where the... Yeah. And it dies, ladies and gentlemen. Ren, are you still there? Damn it. We're gonna die. Yeah, I guess that'd be too easy. We're dead. So, want to truck over to Milner first, see about that radio? I mean, yeah. Clarissa can be a handful, but gotta take the bitter with the sweet. Uh, yeah. If we can connect to the mainland and get somebody over here, we should do it as soon as we can. Uh oh My thoughts so. exactly. All right, our rescuing duties have officially commenced. Let's get this done and get off this rock like the badasses we are. 
Good one. Yeah. Righteous. Why would I want to get a Clarissa? We're gonna go help Ran. Because Ran is my best friend. Why are you waiting? Okay, don't scare me like that, freak. <clears throat> hey, can I borrow your... Are you gonna... Are you gonna come? Alright, well, I'll see you later then. How are you... Uh, doing? I'm fine, I guess. Why? Just checking, you know? Okay, how are you? Wait, if you want to see Clarissa, this is the wrong way, right? This is the way to get Ren. Fort Milner's the opposite way. Yeah, you know what? I thought about it and let's just get Ren. He's like practically right here. Hey, fine by me. Okay. I um, didn't realize just how much woods there were. This is like a, like a genuine forest. What's the matter? Not the outdoorsy <laughs> type? Well, if it's in a city with concrete and a little open all-night pancake place, then yeah, I'm outdoorsy in that I'm outdoors. But I just what? want to make sure... Boo! You know, we know where we're going? Yeah, of course. It's just over the river and through the wood, like the song. Yeah, but in the song, the horse knew the way to carry the sleigh. I'm the the horse! White and whatever snow. Yeah, and in this particular scenario, I'm the, I'm the horse. noble steed who will lead us merrily to grandmother's house. And grandmother being. Be careful. Being Ren, right. You know, this whole place really creepily reminds me of a park or woods. Damn. Oh, Jesus, what are you doing jumping across that? There's another, there's like another way down here. Look, Jonas, I do like a million jumping jacks a day. This is nothing. A million. Oh, I didn't realize. Sorry. My dad was really happy to move here, you know? He said the schools were safer, less knifings per capita. I guess he never considered the danger <laughs> of whatever's happening right now. But, you know... Every yeah, we once had a mall Santa who was kidnapping kids. God. I think that's been so far the scariest thing that's happened. Well, I mean, to be fair, that does sound pretty scary. Isn't this, uh... Yeah, that's, that'd be the way we'd went if, uh... Ran was with us. Yeah, up here's Ren, I believe. Um, why is there a cable car here? Couldn't they have just made, like, just like a normal bridge? Yeah, it's kind of neat, right? It's like going on a gondola ride. I don't know if I'd say it's neat. It looks less than welcoming. Or at least it doesn't look very inviting. Look, or it's a little scary, but Ren needs us, so... Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. All right, well, let's just see if we gotta take the, um, conveyor thing. It's been rotting here since the invention of ovens. We're just gonna actually climb the woods. We'll go this way. How are you standing on air? Box six. Well, how do you know you're Bobby Dunbar? I know who I am. And I know who you are. And nothing else makes a difference. It says it's the, I don't know, Catford station? And the call sign is weird. 60.8? The dial doesn't go that far. Alright, you stand up there and keep floating. I'm gonna go down here. I thought there's someone there. There's the house. Power transfer station 167. Oh, it's open. Okay, that's a little strange. Why wouldn't they lock it? I mean, somebody should have locked it, right? Maybe the guy in charge of the forest closet forgot. Maybe. Or he's dead. <sighs> Jonas. I'm just saying, maybe he's dead. I found the circuit breaker. Wait, like the first thing it says is, beware of overload. Do not attempt restart without supervision. Um, so I don't know. Terrific, you'll be my supervisor. Supervisor Jonas. So what does it say to do? Just let me do it. That way, okay. if something bad happens, you know. Uh, okay. Thanks. No problem. It's just that you know, kind of, your way around here. You know Ren. If someone were to get electrocuted, it should be me, right? All right. It makes I guess. some kind of circus sense. I'm sure you'll be fine. All right. Um, 
Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> Damn it. Because fucking goddamn Jonas got stuck on the wall. I don't get stuck on the wall this time. I really just don't like... I can't think of a way to delicately put this, but... What? Someone with two X chromosomes doing it? Someone who shaves her legs? That is not it, okay? <laughs> but sure, if you want to be the one to get cooked, go ahead. Fine. Uh, what did you flip? Because it kind of did the opposite of what we wanted. I flipped the... It's the only one, Jonas. What other switch could I even flip? Oh, good point. The lamp's flickering. Do you think it's like on backup power now or something? It sounds like it's emitting some weird noise too, right? Yeah, a little. For some reason it reminds me of the cave. Let's just try to get the power on, alright? Everything about this is making my skin crawl. Okay. Hey, don't worry. Alright, run! It's... I can't believe this. It's locked now. It's okay, we'll just... There's got to be a way to turn the power on still. It would have been better had it never been found. For all those who possess... There we go. That's... That's... God, I haven't heard this in forever. This is something my mom used to- Oh wow, God that kind of startled me. I'm so tired me. of this funhouse bullcrap. Look, dance with me. We got the car going, let's go. Mwah, I did it. You didn't, let's go. Uh, <laughs> was that there before? It was not. I don't- I think so. Alex, are you all right? Ah! Alex! <laughs> <laughs> Not funny. Not funny. <laughs> opposite. Total opposite of funny. Look up. It was worth it. <sighs> what a night. Huh? Can I sit in it again? <sighs> what a night. Um, what does that mean? You said it first. I'm just saying, this this isn't anybody's fault, you know. It just happened. Stuff happens. Yeah, you're right. Stuff happens. It just sucks that we'll be all the right. stuff that's happening is like really terrifying. Humming like a barracuda. Barracudas don't mm. hum. Well, this one is. Bitch, let's go. Praise the Lord. Here we go. Don't worry, Bran. Well, when you look at that, it didn't collapse. That's one good thing that happened tonight. Yep. Yay. You used to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the island, I mean. I mean, that's what Ren made it sound like. Yeah. Well, I don't know about a lot, but a few times. Yeah, I can see this place being cool, like in the summer, or even in the spring. Some people camp here, but it's weird. I, I don't know why they just leave their tent. Looks kind of dumpy. Like, I don't know, like it's been abandoned. But seriously, it's nice having a little getaway like this so close to you. It is. Yeah, it's pretty nice. It can be pretty nice when I... Right? To the island. I mean, I mean, that's what Ren made it sound like. Uh, do you ever get deja vu? What? I feel like, like, didn't we just walk through here? Huh. That's funny. I, I don't think we have. I only mention it because my family trips were awful. My mom would always insist on going to Missouri every and single that... year. What? This is uh, cool. I mean, it was all we could afford, but still. That's a long drive for pretty much nothing. Ah, oh, fascinating, Jonas. When we get back... Wait, wasn't this... We passed this a minute ago, right? And it wasn't burning? 
I am um, honestly don't remember. Yeah, so anyways, I think places are pretty much what you make of them, you know? And not the other way around. Yeah, I think I agree. It's just a theory, anyway. You used to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the islands, I mean. I mean, that's what Ren made it sound like. We have definitely been here before. This is weird. What's weird? Because I don't remember any of this. Jonas, we've already done this. We keep walking past these same trees and this same spot, and you keep asking the same crap over and over. Um, okay? I mean, if you say so, but like, I don't even know what you're saying. What, what are you saying? What is that? <sighs> are we lost? Or is it... I keep repeating this one moment for some... <sighs> reason. God, can't things stay normal for like two friggin' seconds? Well, it's more than a little troubling that I can't tell besides... I like how she's so uh, melodramatic about just it. Noticed, but okay, let's deal with this now, sure. This is, uh, new. It kind of stinks. Yeah, it smells like it's been sitting in a diaper for a month. Take that, ball. Um... What? That's... strange. I'm taking a picture of the ball moving, not your kicking, just so you know. That's... Uh... Okay, I'd, I'd like to know where this is going. Uh... Okay, I'd, I'd like to know where this is going. Is that on the radio? Maybe don't antagonize whoever. Uh... <laughs> it's a good one. I think they have a sense of humor. Oh, what's that? Don't want to play anymore? <laughs> what the oh hell? Oh my god. Alex, can you believe this? This is crazy. Alex, I think we're dealing with ghosts. Just a hunch. Maybe. What else could it be? I mean, really. At least none of Jonas, where where are you? What? This is so this is so cool. Jonas! Are you in this town? happening what is that tell Michael to stay with Clarissa they like each other a lot what are you what's wait wait we've done this before what we're still stuck but I kicked the stupid ball and everything what more do you want it's all right, we must have just missed, um, something. <laughs> Are you, can you kind of remember more now? It's starting to stick. Yeah, I mean, it's still sort of foggy, but whatever, I'll deal with it. This is so cool. Oh, there's a song there. And the campfire's gone. Huh, this look. <laughs> It's like super old, but man, it's almost spotless. It's one of those um, magnetophones, I think they're called. Or some other reel-to-reel -reel thing from the 40s. Why would it be here? You know, I didn't realize I felt like a pressure in my head until right now. Maybe doing that fixed the loop. Yeah, making it sound right did what? I... I don't know, but it's like my allergies cleared up or something. Oh, it has fucking eyes! and get Ren. What the hell? I like this game, it's so weird. It's unique. This 
insane, Jonas. Like, the craziest thing that's happening to anyone right now is happening to us. <sighs> True, but... But... Nah. Okay, so we've gotta go... keep going up, I suppose? I couldn't think of anything to say. What do you think they want? The, uh... I don't know. I just hope they want to, like, play soccer every once in a while, and that's it. My favorite song. into this bench on a school trip once. You don't care, do you? No, please, keep going. <sighs> Forget it. God, what a day. Is that Nona? Oh, shit. What the hell? Did it, don't, don't, okay, just don't move, okay? Don't come anywhere near me. No. Huh. Just don't move. What is it? What's wrong? This night has turned... Banana bread, really fast. And I'm seeing things and forgetting things. And I bumped into you once already, and it was horrible. So, we're... what are you talking about? Back at the beach? I'm talking about the Alex I saw at the pier. After the cave looked like the freaking Fourth of July, and I lost track of everybody. No, no, oh, believe me, that wasn't us. I don't know that yet. So, just look. You're not going to talk about my grandfather. You're just going to stand there, politely, and tell me if you've seen Clarissa. Because I've been looking. Clarissa's No, no, we haven't. But we, uh, we're actually, we're looking for Ren right now. So, have you, have you maybe seen him? No, not Ren. Okay, well... Hey, listen, Nona. You should come with us. That way we're not all, you know, separated. I'm not going anywhere with you. All right. Why? Okay. Hey, I get it. I do. I'm jumpy right now too, but just hold up a second, Nona, okay? Yeah, can you just do us a favor? Can you just can you go to the comm tower and wait for us? We got the lights on there and it seems pretty safe. No, Nona, you should really come with us. It's better to stick together. Better for who? Nona, come on. For everyone, for all of us. No. <sighs> and the comm tower is where? It's the cloud buster at the edge of town. Can't miss it. And you. You're really you? Really? No, Nona. I'm a zombie on the hunt for living brains, so... Yes, it's us, Nona. Alright, bye. Nona! Nona! That girl's a peach. She is a person! Wait, isn't that count? Isn't that where we're going to get him? Yeah, all right. <laughs> What's this picture? Oh, that the ball. This is really cool. I like this game. <clears throat> Just for me, I want to know. Back at the bridge, why'd you flip the switch yourself? You could have let me do it. I'm just curious. Oh, come on, Jonas. Are you still on that? We were stuck. I wanted to I'm move things along. The end. All right. I found it, so I did it. Okay, that must be the way station. And 
Actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Like, nobody's going anywhere. Doesn't the whole thing just go in a circle? I bet you know. I bet you know exactly why there used to be tracks here and you're holding out on me. <laughs> huh. I think I remember reading that this well is supposed to be the first thing ever, um, built, or whatever, on the island. Back in the 1600s. It doesn't have a sign or anything. You think I'm kind of a God. slacker idiot, right? No. Like, I wouldn't find any of this stuff interesting? <laughs> Jonas, I think you're smart. Come on, what are you talking about? Hmm, I don't know. I just sometimes get these, like, whiffs of... I don't know. My I can't hearts. think of the word for it. Superiority? No, not that. It's like, I don't know. Nah, it'll come to me. Maybe we can learn something. This is my song that I wrote. Portuguese explorers, Spanish settlers, but few stayed long, preferring the ranch work offered by the mainland. After 1890, the island was gifted to Colonel Caleb Edwards for his part in the American Indian Wars, and he would lease it to several mining companies throughout the early 1900s. This relay station served as the center of a makeshift railroad that carted coal to northern and southern piers. When Edwards died, the government saw a hole in national security at the outset of World War II, and decided to take control of the island once again, founding Fort Milner in 1941. This island has had many owners, Portuguese explorers, but much work offered by the mainland. After 1890, the island was gifted to Colonel Caleb Edwards for his part in the American Indian War. He would lease it to several mining companies throughout the early 1900s. This relay station served as the center of a makeshift railroad that carted coal to northern and southern piers. Oh man, thank <laughs> God. I thought you were a werewolf. Why would we be a werewolf? All right, you have all your limbs apparently, so let's use them and go. Do you have, like... Any idea what's going on? Okay, uh, that must be the way uh, station. And actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Damn it, I think we're, we're looping again. There's a ram. Oh, oh, really? It's a zombie. Man, it's kind of weird that you can tell when it's happening. And There's your boy. Hey, Ren, we made it, finally. Um, Ren? Ren! Seriously, Ren, you can have a drug freak out on your own time. I don't have the patience to worry about you right now, so come on, look alive here. What's he doing? Is he, like, sleepwalking? I don't know how he, like, fell asleep during all this, but... Are you in there? Come on, pal, the neighbors are here and they want to borrow some sugar. This isn't a guy on drugs. Not that I want to, like, alarm you. I hope you have a plan B. What the fuck? This is so weird. I guess I'll do... Yeah, I'll do this one some more right here. I don't know if you remember, but the last time we got stuck, we used one of these things to get out of it, so... I'm not just messing around right now. Yeah, I remember, I remember. Kind of. Standing right there. Ben, are you still here? Maybe he's in here again. <coughs> what the hell? Wait, we can't leave without Ren. We came here to do a thing, let's do the thing. I'm not leaving, I'm just walking. All right, it just looked like you were leaving for a second. 
It's always up here. It's a broken phone. I'll look at it, I guess. Ren must have used this to call us. Oh, it looks smashed. Oh, what is he doing right there? Um, the crap. I don't... Maybe we shouldn't, um, go near him? What's... What's happening to him? I have no idea. I mean, I know they say don't move somebody with a spine injury, but it's like... We gotta do something, right? Yeah, um... Any thoughts on what we could do? If I did have any thoughts on what would solve this, wouldn't that be a little weird? Ren, are, are you... Oh, God. Oh, it's going on. Now Ren's plus, so what now? Feels stretched. Better. No. Jonas, where did you... We are abounding. <laughs> what is this? Silly. But do not be stupid. You are dolls. Would uh -huh. never... Plot. Hurt you. Can't hurt you. Can you help us? We're we're stuck here, and we just want to go home. Home, Kamina. We will go home. All of us. Leave. Possible. Uh, maybe, but I, I don't really. Grounded by Adler. So, uh, Margaret. Pretty little poppy. We don't. We don't know what you want. If you could just. Just tell us. What do you want us to do? You. Stay close. Don't leave. Yet. Sit. Still. Bear fruit. Tag. Yeah. Ah! Ah! Holy mother of God! You guys... God, Ren! 
Ren! Jesus, are, are you alright? Yeah, just give me a second. Give me a week. Why? Why is this... why? Actually, thanks for coming, by the way. Sure. Why is this happening? I mean, I've been here. I visited this place like 15 times. We're in big trouble, Ren. Really big trouble. We need to call somebody or get a boat, but we need to get out of here. It's ghosts. She doesn't want to say it, but it's ghosts. And you were possessed by one. <sighs> that doesn't... That doesn't seem like it'd be part of a healthy lifestyle. Guys, does anyone... Is this thing working? If Don't anyone... Can hear this, out there, in a... Whatever. I, I'm at the con tower on Edward Island. That's great. So, if anyone can... What is this? I'm trying to communicate with the... Does she know how to even work that stuff? Doesn't sound like... Ugh. Can't, like, anyone work a two-way radio? Didn't everyone have that, like, one trucker uncle who let them work the CB <laughs> a few times for fun? Guess not. So... Are we going back to the comm tower for Nona, or...? Uh, we should round up Clarissa at Fort Milner first. Look, we'll split up. You guys do that, and I can go tend to the lovely damsel <clears throat> distressed in the old tower. I wish you wouldn't put it that way, but... Can you even make it there? Can I even make it there? Well, you did just have a specter wearing you like a suit. And all that's left is a little indigestion. I'll be fine. All right, well, guess Gosh, we're going I love that how way, melodramatic so these we'll people are. We'll see you at the comm tower. Hopefully with Clarissa. Don't do anything stupid. Not a problem. Huh? Oh, what so is that? Can anyone hear me? Anybody? Clarissa? Yeah, it's can me. Anyone, is this thing working? If anybody can hear me, I'm at Fort Milner in the, uh, I think, crap, I think in the gym or something? Well, she's around here somewhere. I was worried, honestly, that she, um, might have left. She sounded weird. Like, not just staticky weird. It could be the system, or whatever, just the equipment making her sound deformed. I don't know. Ren said something about Fort Milner being decommissioned, right? But, and hear me out, what if it isn't? What if they just said it was decommissioned, and there's, like, still people, like, in there, like, doing stuff? What are you even talking about right now? Just, what if all the stuff that's, like, happened to us, the stuff we've been seeing, is, like, the direct result of some government secret project? Like, what if there's some, um, experimental, uh... Secret project? Like what? They finally harness the power of... Mind control. Yeah, mind control. And they've um, made a mind control machine, and um, and we've all been suffering like a collective mirage. Well, we'll see, I guess, won't we? Clarissa! What? Where are you? That won't help. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, I guess not. All right, I know the answer's no, but we kind of do have to find Clarissa, so... Let's just ignore the question and thank the weird radio men for the door. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, uh, really? Yes, really. <clears throat> well, Clarissa got in through some other door, so we should be fine, hypothetically speaking. Um, speaking of which, she dated Michael? Is that right? Yes, quite annoyingly. I mean, was he the type of guy that would go for that, like, sort of thing? I'm just... What sort of thing? What do you mean? You know, like, intense, I guess is the word I'm trying to find. I mean, just from what I've heard of him, like that one story about the cops just straight buying him a beer? Just, what would a guy like that see in her? Like, at least at the start, there must have been something, right? You know, Jonas, frankly, I don't really know, and I don't really... Ah, uh, can you imagine sleeping here? I'm trying not to. But why would the construction guys leave the bed frames? Seems kind of... I don't know... Kind of morbid. Yeah, it's... It's just strange to see it like this. Graffiti? What's this? Stuff like this. I always thought it was pretty. Kind of like... I don't know, kind of like the buildings being reclaimed by the trees and the soot and the soil, you know? Well, right now it just looks like scary tentacles, so... In the daytime, this is pretty much skater mecca. I can tell. 
Does you want to go up here for some reason? <clears throat> hey, that's a ghost. That was a ghost. Don't just leave me here, Jonas. Wait. I look pretty. Jonas, what happened? Are you all right? Jonas, let me in. I'm not in the mood. Oh my damn door, Jonas. Come on, fuck you too, then. Well, what the hell was that? Don't know what you're doing. Uh, lights. Testing, testing. Um, okay. I can't. I, I can't hear anything outside at all. But luckily, this radio thing's working. Look, whatever. Clarissa's not in here, and it's just a room. So, like, riddle me that first of all, and then second of all, I can't get out. The door opened like a second ago. Can't you? Are you sure you're? Cyborg biscuit. Hello. Are you? Look, is someone there? When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. What is this? What is this? What does this mean? Who who are you? Yeah, I've seen Babis and Butthead a little I, bit. I can't hear anything outside at all, but just open the door. There you go. Okay, what just happened? Cause that that sucked. Uh, Clarissa ran in there, disappeared into the walls, yeah, and I'm not really. She did not. Stuff, it was a ghost. I hated all of that. Oh, here's a padlock code, three four eighteen. It's on a list of, huh? They call codes cookies. Is that slang or something? I don't know, but we got the combo, so great. Hey, did I? Did Did you see that? In In the mirror, the reflection was weird. Uh, don't think I'm nuts or anything, but my reflection kind of gave me like fatherly advice that made. Are you taking a selfie? No a mirror selfie. Let me pose. So. Wait, seriously? Okay, make it snappy. Get it? I'm choosing not to get it. Snapchat me. Yeah. All right. Wait. What's this? Radio locks. <laughs> the technology here has always been. It's like primitive and from the future. Yeah, no, it's something. Oh, we didn't go this way. Three, four. Three, four, one. Three, four, eighteen. And... God, oh. I'm terrible. Who's that? Uh, you tell me. <sighs> I'm just gonna pretend it didn't happen. So, let's just carry on. Yep. I th yeah, it's that fucking thing that had Oz on the dam, on the shadow. I knew I saw that. Oh, uh, gonna hate to go out in that. So, actually, um, before we press on, I've had to go pee for like a while now. So, since we're stuck anyway, I thought I'd. Oh my god, go in the corner then. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know this is like way too much too soon for us right now, but I'm gonna totally explode. Ah, uh, you just paid on me. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Clarissa, now I'm gonna go up here okay, and wash that all. was definitely her. Clarissa, come back. We came to help you. Don't. Ugh. You know, it just occurred to me she could also be having like a Ren episode, a Renisode, possessed or whatever we want to call it. But Ren, Ren acted like he was underwater. The guy could barely move. Yeah. Well, Did you make a drawing, Clarissa? The handprints are a macabre touch. Do you know who did that? Please tell me it's like a known thing teenagers here do or something. Clearly, it's the, uh, the evil, obviously. First they finger paint, then they wear our lungs like scarves. Yeah, well, oh, somebody's yes. got to keep the traditions alive. Oh, what was shit. that? This you. Thing. You heard that, right? I'm sure it's just the, uh, the evil again. 
I forgot this step in between the finger paint and wearing our lungs. They also drop things. I'm. Well, they I don't draw. even know why I ask you. Hello? Is this thing? Is this? God, is this? Is this going out or? Wait, I can. Ugh, I can hear myself. That's not. Uh, something bad. Maybe God, she didn't does, see does anybody... us. I don't know, but whatever. She still has a radio, so we still gotta get to her. High in the Cascade Mountains of Washington, the Navy opens the world's largest radio transmitter. Its like one million watts can flash a message around the world in a tenth of a second. Hey, kids. Wanna play a game? Ugh. God. Can you... can you believe this? What the fuck? No, I can't. Hangman? Be sharp and listen, mister. This is going to tell the classification board a lot about what can be expected of you in the future. How many questions will you be able to get in the allotted time? Like a test? Hey, why are we being tested? What did we do? Here's a simple one to start, so don't hold your breath. What is the name of the school you are standing in? School Ten. we're standing in? Isn't this Nine. like a classroom? Eight. I, I thought it was just like a, a fort. Seven. Six. Five. U.S. Army Radio Communication School. That's the stuff, Charlie. Yeah. Now you're swinging. It all goes into your final rating. You want to get a good rating, don't you? Yes. Sure. You want to be a good soldier? <laughs> yeah, sure. How would we want to be a good soldier? Yeah, sure. If that's if that's what you want. Excellent. Oh, Jesus. What is going on? Ugh, I feel like I'm stuck on a tilt-a-whirl. Just keep the pointer on the button. Question two. What did the communications officers at Fort Milner call codes? Who do you know that? This isn't World War II. Nobody calls call codes cookies. There. Now you're cooking. We are an island race. Oh, and through all our times, the sea has ruled our breaks. All right, if I'm answering the questions, you can leave Jonas out of it, okay? One last round and you've cleared your exam. Pencil's ready. How many officers died in the sinking of the USS Canaloa? Ten. The other ships. Nine. Uh, Above all eight. victories, Eighty five. All Seven. Eighty-five? Correct. Damn, I'm good. Ninety-seven brave men and women died on the USS Canaloa. Eighty-five officers. Twelve passengers. It all adds up to another fact for the classification board. Just another fact among many. I'm literally the best. I didn't need to get that far. Just like my mouth to the This is a kid. Oh. Now I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. Here I am. I didn't need to get that far. Ah. States submarine Canaloa is shown for the first time in Pacific waters patrolling for the enemy. Pacific waters patrolling for the enemy. Through the periscope, the commander looks out over the ocean's surface. Canaloa was lost today, lost at sea near. Why are you here? 
Was it something we? What a question. Never left. What are you? And the panic of the. Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. What? I. That Don't panic, was Jonas. Not fun. Are you feeling better? I'm feeling. Let's start with that. This has been United News. And thank you for listening. This is just unbelievable. Anyone? Can anyone just... That's gotta be Clarissa. Let's get her and get out of here. Or use her Where'd radio and go? get out of here, but... Let's just get out of here. Clarissa's... asleep right now. Be still so as not to wake her. Um... Huh? Cross your fingers. Awesome. Uh, oh, well, look at this. The super twins decided to grace me with their presence. I thought maybe I wasn't good enough for a house call, doctor. Uh, okay, don't even start, Clarissa. We came. We're here. Be happy. All right, don't get all, you know, but be honest. Did you come because I needed help, or did you come because there was a radio? Um, Clarissa... I want to hear it from Alex. No, Clarissa, of course not. The radio's our way out. You're the way out's appendage. Well, this appendage found the radio, so remember that when you're back at home, safe and sound, and snuggled with your stuffed animals. Speaking of the radio, where is it? I don't know. I can't get it to do anything I want. Alex, want to take a look at this? Yes. Yeah, no. This is, <clears throat> this is like a low frequency thing. It, it's just meant for the base. It won't. I don't think it can beam out. <sighs> really? No, no, no. Isn't there a way? Any officers who know your problems full and well will give you a friendly and sympathetic hearing. Who is that? Cross your Jonas, wait. We're in another. <sighs> got looped again. Crap. Well. Just keep me in the loop. I didn't mean to say that. Clarissa! Is oh, there anything fuck. Like, can we cut her down with something? <sighs> Holy crap. What is it? Is something wrong? Or not? Look, Clarissa might be dead in there. What? Why? <laughs> we just heard her. Look, are you feeling okay? I'm not nuts so, Jonas. We've, like, done this. We've gone through this door and seen Clarissa twice now, and once she was hanged, and we're about to do it a third time. Okay, all right, I'm sorry. I believe that. You believe this, so just keep me posted, I guess, on how that develops. Ah, uh, here we go. Clarissa? I would have swore oh, she shit. was in here. Better gone than dead. Oh. Maybe this was the the thing, the radio she was using. If we can get it to, I mean, she got it to kind of work, so. It's not gonna work, Jonas. Huh? How do you know? Jonas, we're in a loop. We already just, it's okay, knock yourself out. Clarissa. Oh, thank God, Clarissa. We saw... But I saw you, Alex. Don't worry. I will never forget that I am an American. What the fuck? Freedom. Oh my God! Why would she do that? I'm dedicated to the principles which make my country free. Why would she do that? We're, we're, we're not... It's not like we're... She killed herself. Oh my God, she just killed herself. They made her... I, I just... Uh, this is... Jonas, this is so horrible. <sighs> I don't... I don't even know what to... We... We should get to the others. I, I can't even imagine telling them. Or... Or how to tell them. I'm... Telling them? I just want to... We have to round them up before anything else... Before anything like this. Like... I don't, e I don't even know what happened here, Jonas. If it's... 
If they're thinking of doing the same thing? We'll... We'll figure it out. This is unbelievable. Just get back to Ren at the comm tower. Maybe he's had better luck than us at anything. Fort Milner was the home of the U.S. Army Radio Communication School, which saw more than 100,000 students take its curriculum. During the years it was open, the school trained troops from the various armed services in applied oral communication, radio and TV broadcasting, telecommunications, and what was then state-of-the-art techniques in code-breaking using an early form of computer technology. The school was moved to Fort Baxter in Southern California when the post closed in 1974, and it still resides there to this day. Fort Milner was the home of the U.S. Army Radio Communication School, which saw more than 100,000 students take its curriculum. During the years it was open, the school trained troops from the various armed services in applied oral communication, radio and TV broadcasting, telecommunications, and what was then state-of-the-art techniques in code-breaking using an early form of computer technology. The school was moved to Fort Baxter in Southern California when the post closed in 1974, and it still resides there to this day. Fort Milner was the home of the U.S. Army Radio Communication School, which saw more than 100,000 students take its curriculum. Mayday! May! Oh, crap. This is it. Ren, this is just coming out of the speakers on the roof thing. It's not... Ugh. My God, is this what I sound like? How can right. anyone stand to listen to me all day? Tower. Just where did Clarissa hobble off to? Let's talk to Ren and Nona before we try and find her, because, like, I don't know, maybe they know something we don't. I saw you guys coming up from the tower. The Dick Tower. I think you mean <laughs> Harden Tower. Please don't ruin that for me. It's all I have left. How's Nona doing? We heard what I imagine was her first radio cast ever earlier. Yeah, no, she's, I don't know. I mean, she's frazzled one moment, then that makes me frazzled, then she sees that I'm frazzled, so she like freezes up. Any luck contacting somebody? Nope, no luck to speak of. <laughs> and honestly, I thought this week was gonna be a big karma dump. I found okay, Ren. How have you tried? And have you tried it more than once? Hey, we've tried. The stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know, it's just Wait, a... second brownie? Ren, please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? Mmm, why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Wait, you're not messing with us? Oh my lord. You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, all right? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back up. That's what it does. If you're down- I cannot believe you. You're gonna keel over in like a purple haze while we try and save our lives. I'm gonna be fine. Last time I just ate too much. This was a gimme. It's baby food. Oh God. Drug hand. I'm leaving you. This thing doesn't work. Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. Hey, Nona. Night's still going, huh? We heard you on the uh, speaker system. You got that working? That's about all I got working. Uh, sorry I was like, weird earlier. But, hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've been like, out there. Look, we tuned into something in the cave and it was like Gabriel sounded the trumpet. Just everything went terrible. And, uh, ghosts. Yes. Oh! Oh, I got it! This is great! This is perfect! I know exactly what to do. do Are you, you gonna come in, Jonas? Yeah! Totally! 
It's Maggie Adler. Stand out sign talks Maggie everyone. Adler. Yeah, she has a boat. Had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but she's not. She's. Ren, what? You could have mentioned this at any point. I mean, we walked right past it. I know. It. I'm sorry, but I've been like stewing in my own panic here for the last couple hours. My sister Allie worked at the parks office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so no, no, gonna... no. We are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident burnout. Hey, 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 come on. I'm not a burnout. Okay. Well, I mean, Jonas kind of does have a point here. Like, do you know there's a boat, or is this like when Honestly, you need to get drunk? Why does she keep going on? <laughs> come on. I was like 13 when I thought they all got drunk at lunch. This is a real thing. There's a boat at her dock. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? You had Alex bring the radio. You brought us here. Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Guys, Al you know there's no television cameras here, right? Take the energy down a notch. Alex, I am not putting my life in his hands. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Look, you're making him mad. He's pacing. The stories I heard about this guy, he's a maniac, okay? He's going to trash our only legitimate means of getting out of here if you buy into this crap. Legitimate means? What are we even talking about? You have no idea if there's okay, a... Okay, you're arguing 15 things at once now. Do the plan, trust Jonas, leave Ren, like pick a target, or better yet, just don't. Yeah. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there what is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that you wouldn't be okay. Honestly? Anything to get me off this tower and away from this specific configuration of yelling people would do wonders for me right now. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my, like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. Just you... shut up, both of you. Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night. Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. Keeping in mind who's taller, who do you want coming with you? Nona, wanna come with me? What? Really? I mean, I guess. Why this are you isn't... making me shack up with it's this guy? It's my friggin' We've been plan. Together the... We'll be back later, so play nice in the meantime. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is it's fine. This will be a good... Well, y'all argue too much. you don't want to don't take sides, but no. Nobody's happy with this. Uh. Yeah, well, I don't really care right now what you're happy with. See you soon. No hard feelings, right? I'll see you when you get back, Alex. Oh my god, get over yourself. I, I can't get through doors. There we go. I guess I'll go see what the fuck's up with the ran. Now, don't get depressed and eat any more brownies, okay? I still need you tip top, all right? Good luck with the thing, Alex. Whatever. Ow, you fucking hit me with your cigarette. I'm gonna punch you in the mouth. Kissed you. Come on. Come on, Nona. God, these guys are annoying. You know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh, back, behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, hey, it's, it's nothing to be sorry about. I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you'd remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's a loophole where, I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, you get a detention, and if you don't go to that, you get suspended. But suspensions are like paid vacation, you can just do your work over. So... 
Oh, wait. If you don't really go to, like, class... I guess we're calming down? Yeah. Nope. Jump. See? Nona didn't fucking complain about it, Jonas. is famously named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant slaughtering of countless families during one of the great ethnic cleansings of the 20th century. The forceful removal of an ignorant people to make space for destined holders is a time-honored tradition in our still young country. And you will be a part of that heritage, Alex. Do not resist. It will be over soon. What the fuck? I'm Alex. This early version of what would today be considered a blast and fallout shelter was commissioned and built in 1946. The above ground hub leads to a bunker 60 feet beneath the Earth's surface, molded with layers of poured concrete and packed earth. The lead blast door will only unlock through use of the call and response system, a setup devised by Lieutenant Commander Matthew Feinberg to prevent tampering. If the Catbird Station, a small watch point in Edwards Forest, radios in a decoded attack, the shelter door will automatically open, triggering an alarm and compulsory evacuation. So, it's the Parks and Facilities Building. That's down a bit, right? If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yeah, we're... we're close. Clarissa! What are you... How did she get up there? What are you doing? Clarissa, where have you been? The last time we saw you jumped out a window. I, I mean, I thought... We thought you were dead. Clarissa, what? Oh, great. Christ, what's wrong with her? Clarissa, can you? Can you hear me? Clarissa, wake up. Fight them off. Take control of yourself. Um, hang in there, baby. <laughs> Alex, uh, please, can you just... I don't know what you can do, but can you just do something? Please, just try anything. Like, uh, Clarissa! This happened to Jonas, too. It's... it's... Uh, I don't know. It's like when they want to talk or something. Oh, God. Clarissa, can you... Can you hear me? Alex, come on. Just please try and get her down. At least, please, somehow. Clarissa, can you come down? Oh, she just looks awful. machine has no more heart than a brain. No more heart. Damn. Oh, god damn it. Is she okay? Or she's I think so. Oh, Clarissa, are you okay? <sighs> you scared the crap out of us. I'm fine. I can I'm fine. Okay. Are you sure? Cause that didn't look great. <sighs> Do you remember anything that happened? Seeing you? That was a while ago. How did I get here? You don't remember how you got here? There's been, like, time disturbances or something, and I think that's what's been teleporting people around, so... And we just had time disturbances. So you're just blank? No, I remember something. I remember you with that radio. <laughs> Bless me. And I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's what turn already? What the fuck? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Oh, guys, okay, I know you think we're still playing truth or slap or whatever, but this isn't real, so... Well, wait. Clarissa hasn't gotten the chance to ask something yet, so... Yeah, and you, of all people, should know what my question is going to be, because I'm not going to waste it. Alex, what did you do? 
Explain why me and my best friend, and your idiot best friend, and your new step <sighs> Look, when we went into the cave, we found a thing, and I used the radio to somehow tune it in, and I think it jump-started everything. I see. But I mean, come on, like, who knew this would happen? We thought it was a weird trick of light or something. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course it's her fault. There's no other way this story goes. Why? Why does it have to be my fault? Why does it have to be your fault? Are you kidding no, me? No, come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right You're now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God, the town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her freaking forehead. And the giant, lit up, Christmas tree reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. Because of her. Like, it would take a very sick person to see it that way, and I would love to hear the explanation. Michael was gonna leave town. He was free. He was out of here until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. And he drowned. He drowned in Horn Lake while this one could barely flap her arms. Clarissa! It doesn't make it my fault! Anyone could have been there, anyone, and then they would have had to watch him die, you unbelievable prick! Anyone wouldn't have watched him die, Alex. Anyone else would have done something. Okay, I'm sorry, but enough. Clarissa, that's enough. It's too much right now. I can't, I can't believe, ugh. She is, Seriously. Nona, it was awful, all right? It, it's still awful, and, and I, I don't, just, Alex, this is none of my business, okay? None. But we came here to do a thing, and that thing is gonna get us home. So, let's get home. No. Uh, Clarissa, what are you- All the Alex in free. Hey. Whoa. Vu? Jeez, I just got a serious thing of goosebumps from one. Boy. Uh, I guess you don't remember, like, anything that just happened, right? Um, to what? Anything are you referring, exactly? Clarissa, like, totally freaking out on me. Blaming me for everything more than everything? Like, like just now? Um, nope. I don't really remember that. Okay, well, the office- Yep, this isn't budging. Um, I don't know about that. I think, yeah, I think we can just bust our way through, honestly. The lock looks pretty worn. Bust our way through? What is that supposed to mean? I think we should try it. <laughs> that was very anticlimactic. Cross your fingers and hold your thumbs. Hey, know what kind of jet that is? Nope. Cool. Carry on. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio, I think, but it's like there's way more stations on the dial. Ooh, neato. Here's another one. It says, they're wall radios, wave-assisted lock, whatever that means. Oh, duh. It says right here that each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. So they're like ID tags or something. Uh, okay, cool, great. Ooh, wait, wait, here's like a, wait. What is this? Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Why would her stuff be here? Didn't her family, or like, hasn't her family been carting her things back to town? No, we can start back. I just wanna, okay, here. To whom it should concern, this island and its history is a lie. Jeez, she didn't have fond memories of this place, did she? What, what, what is that? Who, who's it for? To I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. Oh my god, the, the Canaloa was destroyed by friendly fire? We, we've been lied to all this time. But now I feel any further inaction may carry a far greater risk. Forces outside our control, like, like ghosts or the army, or what was she talking about? Let me finish then. Inside, you'll find two wall-equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to the nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Find these beacons and the notes within, and discover the true chronicle of the island. 
Huh? What the hell is she talking about? It's like if we use these new radios, we can tune into 140.1 and hear like instructions that will lead us to buried stuff. I don't know. To whosoever finds the material, know that I'm discomfited in keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I help preserve. But also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. And truly for the interest of time itself. Margaret Adler. Oh Christ, this is... This is like literally a treasure map. Well, kinda. It's neat, but I don't know. We should probably just get home before we, like, die. <laughs> Alex, why are you wearing that jacket? It's like 75 degrees and the sun's out, you know? You're wearing a toboggan hat jacket. Thought you said you were gonna go swimming anyway. You bring a jacket, but you don't bring a swimsuit. Oh, wow. The sun is not out. The sun is... I guess it barely came out just now. But see, this is when I get punished for watching the weatherman. He said it was going to be like overcast. He said there was a chance for clouds. What hey, the Michael, hell? we didn't bring drinks. Did we? I thought we said we'd bring drinks. Am I. Did I get stuck in time or something? No, I know. Days going by like crazy fast, right? I feel like we're practically just accosted Move. by those soccer players. No, I mean, in this. Time period. Oh, geez, uh oh, man. I wonder who that Special is. Nostalgia trip already? <laughs> I get it, Alex. I would have been happier <clears throat> in the seventies. The seventies. It's like the worst time. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I think she's talking about the. Oh, the the car. No, they don't. Listen, mom and dad know. No, they don't care. Really far well, just to get I mean, on the hill. They cared a little. But they know I can fix it. No, 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 no. Just listen to me. You will drown. Not here, but at Horn Lake. Back at home. You seem really confident. She seems confident. I'm a little nervous. I would be. Relax, Alex. I'm going to teach you how to swim at the pool in the park. Don't worry about it. Today turned out to be a flawless day. It really did. Done. You, yeah, got, you did. ran really did. fast. I wanted to bring a kite, but I thought you'd laugh at me. This is really quite insane what's happening right now i'm just sorry that apparently nobody realizes how insane this is i know right nobody really appreciates it when conditions are this good no it is perfect ice cream and tennis weather that is rare the fuck? i did not expect to be playing this game for like fucking, what is it like god almost three hours now it's been a spell since we did something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? Oh. What's been going on? How's classes? How's... Truthfully, I've, um... I... Ah, sorry. I think... Yeah, I... <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry, because... This is my favorite game something. to play. <laughs> oh, God, you idiot. Go get it Love this it game. Leaves. When I get back, I want to hear an Alex story. No. <laughs> well, can't I just come with you? I'll take two seconds. Think of something to tell me. Fun. I'm gonna tell you about so, the time I lost my virginity. Uh, <laughs> do you... Well, I guess you don't remember anything, <clears throat> right? What am I meant to remember? I'm sorry, did I forget something? I'm bad with... dates. Uh, forget it. It's alright. Um, I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad you were cool with it, I mean. I know you guys are really close and like... I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could, like, continue to do things together. Yeah, I uh, totally understand. And, yeah, let's uh, do stuff, you know. Cool, cool. Michael, uh, he loves you, like, a lot. I'm sure you know that, but he talks about you all the time. <laughs> oh, Alex did this, and... Alex let the frogs out in science class. Isn't she hilarious? Yeah, well, I love him too. I had to fight the skipper for it, but he didn't reckon how many squats I could do. What's it up to? Six? Only on burrito days. Ah, oh, Jesus, thank God you're back. It's like an eternity sitting here with oh, okay. this one. Oh, okay. Let me sit down. Go on. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> oh, I know what she's talking about. <laughs> hey! Sorry, I didn't mean to be a I'm bitch. I'm interesting. I'm entertaining. I'd crush a debutante's ball or whatever. Sure. <laughs> So, I actually really want a cold something, so I'm gonna run into town and get like a soda. Anybody want anything? 
Um, uh, a drink. Uh, yeah. Get me a drink, too? Sure. I'll be back. Thanks. I want 12 okay, Dr. I'm Peppers, please. Story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's going All on? All right. Um. I've missed you, man. I, I've just missed you a lot. That's all. Hey, come on. I've missed you, too. And I know I've been hanging out with Princess, but... What? two-way thing. You can knock on my door. We live in the same house. We gotta bring back movie night. And board game night. <laughs> all the nights. Yeah. God, this is sad, sure. Chanda. And look, I know this was supposed <laughs> to be our day, but I completely forgot I promised Clarissa I'd do something with her, so... Thanks for chaperoning. I know it's not what you had in mind, so... Um... But I owe you. It just... Don't let it happen again. If we're hanging out, we're hanging out. I don't need the pep squad trailing us. Hey, she's yeah. a little more to me than the pep squad, okay? She's a cool girl. You just have to know her a little better. It's important to me that you like Clarissa, Alex. So I do. Tell she's all right, I guess. What do you really think of her? She's just all right. Um, stick with it. Just do what you want. God, do what you want, man. Don't ask me for advice. <laughs> okay, I'm taking that as endorsement, just so you know. Fun. Good. You know, I never noticed. That's a good looking jacket. I should ask for it back. No. I don't like my new one. Feels like I got shoes on my arms or something. No way, Bucko. <laughs> you can't, like, give Bucko. someone you haven't called me that my freaking jacket and then take it back. It's my jacket now, you Indian giver. Alex? I need some are you... All right, are you back with me now? Man, you've been yeah. acting like a... I don't even know how to put it, like a bird, just flitting around in circles <laughs> for 10 minutes. I am not I a bird. I was about to like slap you or scream or something. It's been not fun to watch in light of everything. I, uh, I, I don't know. What was I doing? Well, let's see. First you stopped walking, then you started spinning. Slowly, like a dying top. I mean like this? And then you were talking about sandwiches, like in your sleep. I thought, honestly, I was watching your brain melt. I... I was? Yeah. It was just like you... You totally lost all your wind. But, I mean, you seem okay now, so let's just get to the gate quick and do this thing and get home. Hey, why aren't you at the tower? This one got a little antsy. Weird stuff was playing on the radio. That voice said I had a mother's laugh. What does that even mean? Anyways, are we happy? We are happy. We got a new radio that's supposed to open doors and gates in some magical way. Oh, thank God. I was getting nervous that you would have walked all that way and then not found anything. Seeing as how it was my advice to uh, do the whole thing, but it worked out so great. Some <sighs> weird stuff happened along the way, but I mean, I guess whatever, that's the new normal now. Weird stuff? And we can't find Clarissa, so she pretty much got transmogrified to someplace else. It's sad that any of those words make any sense to me, but... Yeah, should we maybe look for her, possibly? Even if the boat plan works, we shouldn't leave her here. Listen, if we have the key, which is apparently this radio, then let's just go to the house and see. And if it looks like we can leave that way, then we'll go on a Clarissa hunt. <sighs> All right. I think you're supposed to use the radio to tune into the... I'm doing it, Ran. Cool. Oh, wow. Neat. <sighs> Please have a boat. Please have a boat. We're Jesus, gonna go steal this boat. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de... There's the boat. Uh, she does have a boat. Yeah, see? Allie knew what she was talking about. She should, anyway. Oh, look. I mean, she she had to her back and forth here like all Our mailbox lady leaves our mailbox open all the time. Parkour. I was just getting in stairs. Oh. Oh, it's like a... It's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And before we go oh, crazy, shit. it's not... It wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No. We looked through all of her stuff, I think. Huh. So, I'm out, well, bitches. Uh, What's plan B if we can't find it? Um, keys, they... They have to be in the house for the mover. Sometimes when I lock myself out of my house, I'll just... I can't help but just stare at the deadbolt trying to, like, hypnotize it to open or something. You ever do that? Um, not really, but we oh, can try that now radio. if you think it'll help. No, I'm gonna get my radio out. Jonas is following me because that's my boyfriend. I 
That is a nifty gizmo. You're a gizmo. Let's go. Let's gizmo go. What if Christina's in here? Oh, oh, she is! You scare me. Thought you were like Maggie Adler's dead body or something. How would that make sense? How do you get in here? The She's door dead. was locked. Do you have like a radio? No, I don't have a radio. The kitchen window was open. Kitchen window? Where? I don't believe you. These windows don't even... They don't work like that. How would you know you've never been here? Look, Clarissa's here, so everyone's here now. We can just... Everyone's okay, all right? That's uh, a good yeah, thing. Yeah, let's just... Find the keys to the boat, or a phone, Clarissa's or whatever, dead. and just find a way home. I promise. We can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. I don't care what she says, just everyone keep your eye on her. Yeah, I just might climb through the kitchen window again, who knows? Okay, we get it. Haha, -ha, carry on. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. <sighs> Obviously, this it's isn't gonna work. Disconnected. Bummer. I want the bookshelf. Man, she owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Where are y'all going? Robotic thermodynamics and religion. Sheesh, okay, there's a lot of... Okay, we get it. She liked the smell of paper. You can't Passing even hear me. Insight. We'll all miss her dearly. Okay, why don't you get off your ass and help then? I am helping Shh. by keeping out of the way of more enterprising sorts like yourself. Ugh. I want to talk to Jonas. How are you doing? How are you doing? Look, Jonas, are we, like, okay? I mean, because of the whole taking not you to town thing. <sighs> I'm not going to pretend it didn't bother me a little, but it'd be stupid to, like, tonight has been bad enough. Why did they go into the crap basement? About that. I mean, are you, like, mad at me or something? I'm not mad at you. No, no, we're... I want to be okay with you. I just... If we keep at each other's throats, I don't know if I'll be able to make it through the night. Me neither. So let's just not be at each other's throats anymore. Oh, and your there. mouse weird See? looking. Easy. I'm gonna what is this? I'm gonna pull it. Oh, that's an attic? Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Wanna come up? Yeah, sure. Alright, well we gotta do it. Whoa! This is the best day ever. The chest is padlocked. Needs a combination. Mrs. Adler was either paranoid beyond belief or just a very tidy woman. Well, she buried information in sonically camouflaged containers, Jonas. My guess is paranoid. I like how far I lean back. Wait, have you seen this? It's like a, a star map or a diagram of planets or something. Yeah, why would she need anything like a map of the universe? By the way, it's not like she's um, bouncing sure stuff off satellites right for now. a job. Uh, or maybe they were back then. What do I know? Maybe they needed to. For some chart reason, it's not working on mobile devices. Through space or something. Yeah, maybe. So, if you can, then watch it on a laptop. If not, then uh, you just wait for it to hit YouTube. Oh, it's a it's a draft of her letter that she left in the office. To whom it should concern. She left notes everywhere. She said, hidden with secret signals. She was an odd one. I'll give her that. But you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something. You ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Uh, Maybe, but also things don't have on. to make sense. <laughs> Sometimes stuff guy? just happens, and parents? that's the end of it. You kids better go. Oh, um, Chad's lake house. Yeah, yeah, that guy was a friggin' weirdo. Uh, yeah. Jump down. Oh, I keep on thinking it's a damn ramp. <laughs> Wait, There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. Never doubt me. And here's the combination for the... There's a, a padlock chest in the attic upstairs. 29, 18, 54. Uh, cool? Very cool. She made a lot of what should I call these they're reels. slides? They're they're not videos. Um, silent memories. Find anything useful? Not yet. But you know, the night is young. How are you? Um, how are you feeling? Like physically? Everyone kind of looks like they have the flu. 
What do you care how I'm feeling? Main Street, did I do something that bad? Well, you were being a total goober. What do you want me to say? I mean, a second brownie. You know that was dumb. And what did it affect? Nothing. I don't even know why I'm arguing with you. Just forget I said anything. Go about your business. All right. So you're being extra. You're doing the most right now. That's why Jonas is my boyfriend's stepbrother. <clears throat> 29, 18, 54. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. Is this... Ah, the boat keys. Got them. Got them. Perfecto. All right, yeah, we got like keys for the boat. Too. Where? Jonas found them in a chest upstairs. So, say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I was just saying it. It's not directed at you or anything. That mirror's okay. gonna do something weird. I knew it. Alex. Great, now everyone's dead. Oh, Alex. Come down here, please. We have uh, something we want to show you. <laughs> I'm not... I'm not listening to this, all right? I'm not playing along anymore. I'm not listening to you. Oh, just come down, and we'll drink to our future. <laughs> come down, okay? It'll be all right, I promise. <laughs> oh, Lord. You killed everyone. Here comes a candle to light you to bed. Nona, can you... can you hear me? Of course she can't. She's in the fetal position. No one in the fetal position can hear you. Ren, come on. We got a boat to catch, buddy. <laughs> like how she's acting like this is so natural. Like, come on, guys. What are you doing? Let's go. I don't know how you fell asleep so fast. I know someone's in this mirror. Come on, Jonas. Up and at him. She says unnervously. Right. Where's Christina? Ah, there you are. Hi, there you now are. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. Ah. But don't fret. Ah. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. Ah. All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Stop. Just stop whatever this is, can't you? Just just fix my friends. Staying right here on Please. the stairs. Your friends are as fine as they've ever been, okay? There's nothing to bleed over. You signed up for this, Alexandra. In the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. Why was I meant to know what the hell was gonna happen? And yet, without understanding you your footing, you still acted. But don't worry. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house, and you will go and find it. Great. See? As simple and good humor as your mother is. What is it with you guys and all the, the games? You're like dogs or children. Just what is the point? The point, dear. The point is that they were never games. Let's start with the softball. I spy with my little eye radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So. What do you mean, radiation? Is it. Are you talking about the TV? Very good. Well done. The older models emitted X rays. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation. Pay attention. What are you even talking about? I spy with my little eye a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Uh, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Uh, is it the, the this painting? It, it looks kind of like a knot. Excellent, excellent. You're doing so well. Uh. It's ah. time for the bonus round, ah. Alex, so ah. stay quick. Ah. This is what you really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Hey, fast now. The, the picture of, of, I guess it's Maggie, Adler, and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very, very nice. Ah. That's ah. Margaret Adler and a friend ah. Ah. You see, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing, well, this has sort of happened before. 
Maggie and Apple tried to sport with us many years ago, and well, I'm gonna listen to you. I'm gonna listen to my radio. Only one survived, but in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time and a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. What is it? How how can you how can you come back from something like this? And not an eternal recurrence. The waves. I know. It's the waves we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends as sunlight blooms into flowers. Stop that. And we will grow. And we will engulf. Wait, what what happens to them after you're absorbed? Their form will exist with us inside. It will be a swap, you see, of essences, I guess you could call them. Uh, we tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here on the island. And it will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. No, I don't want to. And on to the next. Please just don't do this. We're we're it's not It's sad, I know, to lose the facility to feel, to be, but we have not felt anything for a very long time. And we'll do whatever is necessary. Our castle dashed on the rocks. We have until dawn, and so will you. We would spend our time wisely, and we thank you for your good service. Oh. Well, that could have gone better. Not everyone's dead. Oh. Fucking that. Biscuit. They keep pop more keep popping up. So we can go on. <laughs> I always think I'm gonna be. Uh, does anyone buy the whole eternal recurrence thing? Literally? No idea what you're talking about right now. Yeah, what's that again? Is that like reincarnation? It's when. It's the idea that if time is infinite and matter is finite, then everything will eventually repeat in the same exact pattern again and again. I subscribe to whatever snake handlers believe in, so. Oh, um, God, come on, let's leave. Christina's gone, isn't she? Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos. Yeah. I'm sure this is just the, uh... God, it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look <clears throat> at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave. Just like from another angle. According okay. to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But, won't it be, like, locked or something, We've right? got the radio. Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. The radio. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's... that's going a little above. Above and beyond. 
Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. Yeah, but that's, like, scary. Well, something better work. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry, this is like, this looks like the end, but from the, from the wrong film thing. No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See? It says, when oh, someone okay. sends an emergency signal from the Capard station in the woods, and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. All right, but come on, Nona, do you honestly believe that the old equipment in either building will still work? It's, I don't know, but it's the only thing we have so far. And time's a clicking. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Wait, wait, I, um, I'm sorry, I kind of zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are team, um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are awesome squad. <laughs> uh, I want that one. And we're splitting no. up to work on we're some awesome old fangled squad. machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, save our lives or whatever. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please, don't tell me, I won't want to know. Same here, I don't want to know nothing. No oh, fuck is Christine and why isn't anyone concerned about her? No, oh, now I got a headache. Great. Alex. Alex, okay. Are you are you back to normal? Look, I think I'm sorry, but I think Ren might be in trouble. Why? I just saw, it, it, it was like a premonition, I think, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. Uh-oh, uh, that's not good. I guess I'd been convincing myself I was immune because of my generally happy demeanor. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than... But the thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it, I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. Fine, he better not be drowning, though. You know what time it is? It's four in the morning, which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually in uh, that situation? Usually, I'm asleep at 11 with my hand half dunked in the chip bowl. <laughs> you think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. It is all we have, yeah. I just... I just wish I felt I like the ghosts this, were concerned um, stuff that their plan won't work. Stuff is pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Um, yeah, it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Yeah. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. <sighs> hope this works. Yeah, I hope you don't get stuck on this wall again like last time. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. God, we're in another loop de loo always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? <sighs> yeah, they do. Thanks for the update. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also... <laughs> hope that. Okay, so what? You don't want me to go that way? Jesus. So do I go this way? What do you want from me right now? I 
Oh my lord. What in the hell? Oh well fuck you too. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren's... he's... he had an accident. He... he died. I couldn't... He's floating. No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Alex. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry, Nona. I didn't mean anything. What happened? He... he drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... He just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And done, in this case, is particularly done. I know you're not Jonas, so there's no use in pretending. I like how monotone she is. It'll be an absolute. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. And you... Closing the tear in the cave might work. Y you don't know that for sure. We do know that for sure. We've seen others try, we've seen you try. So pay attention. It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss, we won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. We only really need the one, anyway. I don't, I don't get it. Why do you even need my permission if you have her already? Don't misunderstand. We don't need anything from you except what we can willingly take. We're merely offering you an arrangement that would leave both parties satisfied. Well, somewhat satisfied. Your friends would be fine. And your not-so-friend is none of your concern anyway. <laughs> well, you can't say we never tried. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Fine. Shoot. How do you know? We know because we can be... ...souls as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't provide you all the rules. Now he's gonna disappear. Don't fucking shoot me over here. Was... I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just gone. Nona, how could you not know? You guys were. He wouldn't leave your side. How could you miss this? I don't know. It was. He was she like killed there. Him. He you was killed right him. There with me, and I turned around, and it was as if he had just gone blank. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's. I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. He was more important. No, not really. Ren would be flattered to hear you say anything about him. So, if he can hear this at all. Trust me, he's over the moon right now. Sure. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. And I don't know if he did. He hopes you did. I think that's enough. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. Station's up at the top of the. Ugh. God, that was. My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. The ghosts, they tried to make like a deal with me for Clarissa's life. I didn't take it, of course, but. I don't know. I, I just thought you should know. 
God, that must mean they're getting desperate or something. If they had any, like, power over the situation, they wouldn't try to work out a compromise. Anyway. Hello? Anyone there? Huh? What? Are they? Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? Life. <gasps> that's all I care about. Hey, anybody! God. Jonas? Yeah, no, that's a... That's Jonas, Jonas too. punch Alex if you can hear this. Seriously, right in this room. Jonas, don't listen. We're all set here for the, uh, right. the thing? Locked. The machinery, speaking hunk, or whatever we're doing. Okay, I just have to take yeah, it. Yeah, let's do it. Time's a-wasting. Like, actually wasted. Like, I feel my body wasting away. No, it's, it's okay if you're, like, dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The, uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell uh, off the bridge. Oh my god! You... Hello! We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello! This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Oh, thank god. I'd like to report a poltergeist. They've come into my house, they've shaved all my cats, they look better in my this. business. <laughs> this game's oh, great. I just need any and all advice you can give me. Well, first... Everyone just shut up. You can play dress up phone time when you get home. All right, Mr. No Fun. No Fun? What is that? Swedish? Man, you guys are a real comedy team here. Stunning. The wit on display. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Hey, we're awesome. Awesome enough, at least. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and now. I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Couldn't we have him reborn? Oh no, come on, Jonas, don't turn freaky now. Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. <laughs> but I'm... I think, um... What is it... like, what does it feel like when that happens? Is you forget stuff, really, and then it snowballs into not remembering how to walk or talk and... But you, like... See stuff, right? Like when I saw my mouse, my mouse. Yeah, I, I see stuff, but it's like I don't know. They're like dreams. They just dissolve oh, when I'm back. I think I need to go down. Actually, I don't think we're fine. Scary, needless to say, when I like drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like just like how do I say this? Because I don't want to. It's just, okay, Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. I just want to say. I just. I think it would have been a. Interesting us living together for whatever senior year, and I'm just glad I met you. That's all I'm just glad we met Oh, Jonas you big sap. Okay. All right. That's all nothing to see here And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing Okay And we're gonna be fine by the way you don't have to put it like it would have been whatever to live together Okay, I'm gonna- I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight, but... You know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash- Oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, cause whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. I don't really care about the reasons, just for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. But you, you know what I mean. Wow, big man on campus. I don't know why I said that. Big step, that's what I mean, big step. Eh, it's not a big deal. I'm just letting you know, so I don't know. I don't know why, I just wanted to tell you. Come on, let's get to the century before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do like work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. 
Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? I know you think I have it on Easy Street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. You were... are great, though, and... and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well... <laughs> uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Huh, that's actually, <laughs> that's not bad. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> oh, shut up! Speaker you know, off mute, went so you got a little bit of again. nothing there. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's just like a trial period. Like, buying a used car that I can already tell is missing a lot. What? I know. I'm cool. So don't get, like, overly excited. I'm not excited. This is just... This is how I normally stand. All right, but seriously, just don't say anything, okay? I'm not. I won't. What's there even to say? This is... Please, this is like nothing to me. Hey guys, good job on the um... We're dating, we're dating, <laughs> Nona and I, we're gonna date. Rin, dude, what did I just say? What? They asked, right? You asked? Ugh. It's adorable. Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. No, stop. It's one date at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Romantic. Aw, how cute. Riviera is a great movie house. And the ushers can't tell where you're putting your hands if you sit in room, by the way. Please don't tell him that. Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant. Good. I'm glad. This is... I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories, so... I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... Something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghost or whatever, but you've been acting like not you. Ren. No, I just, I don't know. Well, I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and... Really? Now? Right before who knows what? Yeah, before who knows what. Ah, right, fine. That's, that's like picture. why I want to do it, I think. Come on, yes. let's do it. Yes, let's do it. All right, let's take it. Alex, get right. in here. Okay. You're not getting out of it. <sighs> All right. That was a great picture, guys. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. Said what before we go on song? Oof. Okay. I. Uh, all right. We'll be back. Oh, I know. Oh. Adorable. I am coming with you. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Now I have to go hug Christina. It's adorable. Oh. Why does everybody look so concerned except for, uh, Ran? Six of you. Listen, Alex. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but 
The truth of it is, I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kind of getting worse, actually. Just hang in there, Jonas, okay? I know you feel like a garbage snowman right now, but we're almost done. Garbage snowman? Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? <laughs> huh? Have you... No clue. Tim. You call him Tim. <laughs> <sighs> oh, brother. Yeah, it's not one of my finest. <laughs> I was kidding, it was a good one. It's... it feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. Look, I'm gonna flash you. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if... if Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads, I don't know if this place would have held up. If something happens on the other side of this door, just don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. If that's how you feel, but I'm not about to even, like, think like that right now. Think positive. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you know what? There's, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? Yeah, it, it's probably a trick, Jonas. The ghosts know we're closing in on, on booting them out, and they're throwing up distractions to distract you. Maybe you're right, maybe you're right, but, I mean, it, it's ghosts. And I'm not about to throw away the possibility this is something else. I'll be fast, but it's just too strange. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna give you some leeway here, because I'd want it with Michael, so take a look. Okay, good, thank you. It's, like, breaking or something. Can you... can you fix it? I mean, it's just so crazy to keep... It's... it sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just... It's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? You can hear that. The voice, right? I can... kinda hear it. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do you think it's like it could be, right? It's just, w with everything that's happened, she could have come here. It's possible. I mean, a lot's happened tonight in this general realm of craziness, so I'm not going to rule it out. God, she's like so close. You can just, can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even, no clue what's going on, but... Uh, sure, I, I can, I can try, I guess. Yeah, because this, I don't know how to get this clearer or whatever. I just can't, just can't really get this to change, or, uh, Mom, can you, uh. You know, the truth is, we could have left whenever we wanted. We weren't prisoners of the cave. Then just leave then. Why are you... Why are you still here? Why not move on of all of them? Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than... Dying the first time. Yes, I have, actually. 
Oh, what? Sitting in your room breaking from your brother? You're like this one. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Child, wait your turn. Underwater. Fucking submarine. You've come to close the hole. Right, though? Well, you're gonna find out it's not that simple. The horses have already left the barn. Yeah, I've come to close the hole. I've come to... to do what Maggie Adler tried to do 50 years ago, all right? <laughs> okay, well, it didn't work then. Why would it work now? God, you're so spoiled. You don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy will spare your... your friends from our bloom, sure. But it will seal you up in here with us. You'll die with us again and again. So think long and hard about those friends. Well, it'd be an alright way to go if it meant saving some people you care about. One last chance. You don't have to die. You can leave, you know. Through the gate you opened. <sighs> we keep the girl. Riz. She'll still be happier with us. Anyways. So make your choice. Quickly. Well, we still have patience to try. What? No way! I'm not... I'm not just gonna abandon Clarissa. Who do you think I am? Who do... Who do you think we are? Do you think we wanted to be thrown away? Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. They didn't know it was you. Nobody, barely anybody knew. It wasn't just Maggie's fault or their fault. It... It was a catastrophic event. A catastrophic event, you make it sound... <sighs> ...faded? Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. There's... I know there's a crewman on that submarine named Francis, and to you, to all of you, I know it was fate, okay? Sometimes things go Is bad. Is that down there? You'll never change that. Francis... Was our name ever... Francis? Francis. I... almost remember. My... name? Come on, guys. Be... be braver than this. This is a cowardly thing you're trying to do. Be better than that. We... we... Francis Salter. It's hard to remember... certain things. Our faces went a while ago, then our names... is... we're afraid of all we have left. It's kind of the last stitch. That's not all you have. You know that's not all you have. Strapped Keep your nature. We'll keep ours. Maggie had... has... will have... this friend and... you sort of remind us of her. I'm not strange. Take care. <laughs> With the time you have left, child, and take notice of what you choose to.
Tell Michael to stay with Clarissa. They like each other a lot. But Michael's dead. How could I even... Whoa, wait, what? what's happening? Oh, what? Hello, are you... Look, is someone there? Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What, what is... How, how is this possible? What's going on? Well, that could have gone better. Right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go to school here. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. <sighs> it's a dead space. I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, I'm... Th this is our house. <laughs> I'm not. I can't play Amnesia Spy Girl right now. Seriously, pretend to snap Ren's neck on your own time. I've been, like, struggling with this stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have, like, a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. I... I don't know. I, I don't think it has to have a point. Well, that's where we differ, sister. I think things should have points. Things should be sharp. They should poke you. I'm guessing okay. Mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel... It's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. What? That's great! Congratulations! I, I mean, that that's awesome. <laughs> uh, thank you. Thanks. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni, and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I have bored you enough. I'm Michael, say it. Come on, you can't take me to the water's edge of an idea here and then not jump in. That's just cruel. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell Mom or Dad, but Clarissa and I aren't talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and and just doing our own thing, you know? Getting what? Mike, you're kidding me, right? I mean, I know you said you were gonna commit or whatever, but isn't oh, running off like you're in I mean not like that. a bit far? Oh come on, it's not that crazy. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just uh -huh. I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your like blessing first. So can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm all right to do this? I. God, it's hard for me to say since I love you, of course, but you should do it. Totally. Even if it explodes in a nuclear war-style breakup, you'll regret never trying. Thanks. That means a lot. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them, it feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. Michael, what is... What's this for? What, what are you doing? This is just... This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. Michael, I love you. <laughs> look at me. Amazing. Look at me, Michael. So... <laughs> I love you, too. Why was he looking at me? But soon, <clears throat> I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, she's waking up. Is she all right? Ugh. Ouch. Is, um, <clears throat> is everyone doing all right? Still, um, yourselves? Yeah, I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, for the most part. Yeah, my arm fell asleep, Jonas but... carried you here. Yeah, 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 okay. The, the important thing is, whatever you did in the cave, it worked. The tear, the hole, it's fixed. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've 
They've stopped trying to eat our souls. Yeah, it's important to note that. That's... I'm, I'm glad. I'm sorry. I'm just... I was back. I fell back a few years during the whole thing, and... I just saw Michael again. That's all. So, I'm just a little rattled right now. What was it like? Well, wait. Yeah, okay. I well... just talked to him. He, he was there in the... whatever was happening. We talked about his future and what he wanted to do. It was... something. I'm sorry, Alex. Yeah, it's... I'm sure it was rough. No, it was, um... It was good to see him. It was good. He looked good. He looked, um... himself. I had my older sister. It was a night where... I don't even remember why she was mad at me. Probably something I said to our mom. But I don't know why that who cares night would visit. I wouldn't put much thought into it, Clarissa. Really. Yeah, it doesn't matter now. Maybe it's... I don't know, maybe it's like what matters to us showed up or something. The universe doesn't care about what matters to us. Then it doesn't matter anyway. No, I guess it doesn't. I can't what? believe everything that happened. Oh my goodness. I, just, I feel like we should <clears throat> tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... What? No, are you kidding? We have... Well, we don't have evidence of ghosts, but we know there's a continuation. A, a sort of life after death. This is like the moon landing times a billion. Yeah, but... No one's gonna believe it, so... Who cares? Hey, is this your book? Oh man, this is... We're gonna be the best couple ever. Uh, okay. Slow <laughs> down. I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, oh, prom. 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 I am definitely skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are you going, Alex? Oh. <laughs> Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? Uh, I guess. I mean, if I find a date, you know. I'm not gonna go stag. I have my dignity. Ben Owens will ask you. Or rather, he's going to ask you unless I physically prevent him. Eh, you can do better. Come on, come with They're me gonna and Nolan. We'll go dress towards shopping. Clarissa. It'll be fun. It'll be like a movie montage, except none of us are prostitutes and there's no rich guy. Oh, uh, sure. I, I mean, only if you want to. Of course I want to. I'm asking you to. Well, go to Reggie's. If you can find you a stained like one, you get 50% off. Up to you like this? All right. You know what? It's picture time. Oh, picture my time. God. Come on, Nona. <sighs> yeah, I guess we should. Tonight's Let's do it. been um noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is. A way to oh, say it. Yeah, I'd probably picture. say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. You two sure. are the only ones outside. I mean, inside. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half Let the time. Let me stand here awkwardly. Here's good for the... yeah. Just here. Like, is this my look, good son? I'll just pick, like, this, here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon... I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Okay, everyone. All right, shut up. Cheese! And... Uh, I was talking. No, no, God. Oh, look at us. Before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. The island did one good thing, forcing Ren and Nona together. Which is nice, because they're still together, actually. Though, they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. You and 64% of players brought Ren and Nona together. Aww. Clarissa left to study English literature. She was thinking of dropping out, but is keeping at it for now. We talk sometimes. Rarely, but sometimes. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. <laughs> and she got a dog too, if you care. Yeah, I love dogs. You and 41% of players made up with Clarissa. Oh, that's good. Jonas and I are, um, I'll see him every Thanksgiving at least, you know, but I don't think he wants anything more than that. He goes to state so he could be close to his dad, and he loves the town. I'm happy for him. Gone. You and 90% of players kept. Your new stepbrother Jonas at a distance. No, I didn't. It's funny. What, <laughs> what happened on the island used to pop into my head what every else could have single happened? day. And then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's... 
I don't know. It's good, I think. But anyways, I, um... Well, if it matters. School. Um... I left town to go to school. Undeclared. I need time to figure out what I... What I want, I guess. Anyways... Oh, what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Run's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. And I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever. I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? Really good, like I liked it. That was a really good game. I sat here for like fucking god, it's really nice though. It's really cool. Oh, there's a picture of her and her brother. Ugh. It was really good though. I didn't expect me to sit here and fucking play it all the way through, but it's like it had a really good story to it. It was awesome. It was great. It's a great story and a great game. Goodbye. Okay,